I'm still glad that the advanced collection used Nathan Graves as a main guy. Alright, we just killed a zombie dragon, right? So, what's next? We got the push block shit, so... I started to think like when this game came out. Oh, there is the axis. Yeah, poison like two steps away after getting out of the save room. It's not to lower the volume, I swear. It's just too loud. No, that's not it. Alright. There we go. Yeah, we'll make it. I was thinking Was this the first Castlevania game they released for the GBA? It wasn't like Harmony of Peace on the right. Wait, where like all the areas around here where it's like you need to push block? I think they were. I might want to go and check them right. Uh... I mean, we're here, right? Might as well. Is this screen orange again? Sure is. Alright. It's just like, of course, it's good for, you know, not getting your eyes blown out. Oh God. Over here. But also, like, I want to see the game for its true colors. It's true GBA colors. And yeah, this is gonna be the first game that they did for GBA. Because the next one, Harmony of Dissonance, I think it is. Uh, the screen looks white as hell. All the colors are bleached. It's to compensate because Holdar was the. Every time you're gonna get poisoned, you touch, you touch one of these assholes. Couldn't it just be a, a happening of chance? Sometimes you get poisoned, sometimes you don't. Alright. It's just... We got a little back and forth now. Because, I mean... I may be wrong, but I think the Castlevania game before this one, probably, was like Symphony of the Night with the PH1. Oh, look at this dude! Back up All right, get lost, buddy. I'm going to whip you from the back. And apparently, you dropped something, so. This should be in the main room. Can we kill you with one whip? Nope. That great boy. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Hey, it's a two row. Is it better than what we have? I have no idea. Poison. And little like 31 damage too. There will be like an HP up or something at the end of this. <laughs> Look at that. Do you want me to whip? Yeah, thank you. Ah, let me want to. Alright. 
well, since they don't drop anything, I'm just going to skip them. Otherwise, we're going to be here all day. Well, an HPO is uh, it's pretty pretty good, actually. Gotta get them when you can, you know? I'm not sure if I said this before, but the standstill of this sprite, I use it. I use it as a base to redraw it for a, the Minecraft texture pack for one of the paintings because I have no idea what to put. Pretty neat, I'll say. I'm pretty sure it's not illegal, right? <laughs> At least not illegal enough. Because usually, part of the copyright law, as far as they say, they recommend you to understand it, is that if you can remove said thing from your product, aka a reference, and your product still works as intended, then, you know, there's no issue with, with it being in the game. It's just like a reference. But like, if your game, if your game revolves around Mickey Mouse, then sure, right? Gonna get copyright straight to hell. Or an appearance that is a lookalike for Mickey Mouse. Oh, that's a good card, actually. I'm not sure if we can use it. Time to start the complex. Stone! Alright. Keep doing the wrong shit. Yeah, here's something you equip it. That's insane, right? It could be anything, honestly. Until you get the desired effect. Which is not like a stronger tank, that's for sure. Well, we'll show that later. And that does transform into a sun become invulnerable. But it's like invulnerable, invulnerable, or you know, meme invulnerability. Really. Alright, that, that did me for 18. How much do you usually do? 18, yeah. Invulnerability in my ass. Of course, I have those projectiles. I wonder if that's good for anything else. I'll have to keep this quick for a while until I figure out what the hell it does. Nice. I mean, it is running my magic. What it does, who knows? It, it, it bleeped. It bleeps. Gains experience point from walking. Explicitly saying walking, not running. What a weird thing. Also, how much experience is is it is anyways? Because it's like 269. Is one point. Yeah, I kinda need this. You don't mind. I think we're talking about. Yeah, by walking. At least one. It's only one. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright. Fire. Inflict. Alright. Yeah, prefer just be harder, thank you. Uh, maybe one that helps to avoid poison would be nice. Hopefully, I don't die before I actually. Oh god, they do like 18, right? So. Yep, we're dying. 
made in a Fortnite Battle Royale game but with Castlevania characters. <laughs> How will that work? Well, they made one with JoJo, so you know, you can take it from there. <laughs> that game never released here, by the way. It was just an arcade. It was an arcade thing. You don't have anything else experience, so I'm skipping you. Do the boxes stay like that? Nope. Eh, I don't want daggers. Alright, we can push crates. We're down. Night. Oh, you guys don't drop anything, so I'm just going to skip you guys, alright? That's a fucking suck you was. And you dropped something, apparently. Well, I appreciate that, you know. They start dropping, like, the weaker enemies behind and replacing them with stronger ones. Alright, tell you ring. Yep. By 50 points. Mm, Alright. Well. Right now, I only feel like doing a strong attack, so let's play that. But doesn't it do that, like, also increases whatever magic related attack you do? Where are we going, X? I have no idea. Clearly not around here because we need like the rock feather or whatever they call it here. Uh, hmm. I'm not sure what was over there. I don't know if it's a thing that you need to push a crate or something or you know. I don't think this is the next area, but you know, might as well start checking this out. Is that a great one? Keep over it. Oh, holy water. Oh, my, my HP. Very convenient because of the amount of time we got hit. Alright. Mm -hmm. I can probably go to here. Maybe, yeah, because I mean... I think there was something when I need to push a, a crate anyways. We've probably been close to the rock. To the clock tower. The blade sword drop something. What is it? Who knows? A godless, probably. Of course, because that makes sense. <laughs> that is a run. I'm just making sure I leave no stone unturned. <laughs> Going up on a Tuesday. Do you think this game could use like a proper remaster? I mean, I don't know exactly what you're glad. Eh, we're here already. Eh. Uh. Maybe made them look like blood stain or something like that, but maybe that's a little too much work. That's it. I trip on the marionette. Oh, well, we can save here. I'm thinking we're already near it, but you know, might as well, right? It can also alleviate the course. Yep. 
All right. Probably just another whatever opting. So let's get get, get it going. All right. Do that again. Ah, oh, well, nice. Except I can use this. One more thing, Chris, anyways. Maybe I, I'm going to check next time. Alright. Alright, they're not that strong anymore. And they drop something. Sorry that. But you drop something else. Yeah, probably drop something else. A card actually, so <laughs> wait, let me look at the tiles for this. Okay. Need me. That you're going to give me that shit. Going around the log without talking, but I mean, I guess it's what it is. But I mean, I guess I wanted to talk about if this if these games were to be remade, what would what would they need to have? I think that plus things type of remaster would be like a safe option. But I mean, it's not like there's anything wrong with them as they are. I mean, they're pretty playable, and considering they just like re-release them in a nice package, <laughs> maybe it's not that crazy, you know. But I mean, they don't need like anything else really. There was a couple of lepers. Oh god. Fuck you. Eh. Hey. Oh my god, unbelievable. Well, they do have an anticorps, right? <laughs> so let's not get here again. Your son, what do you know? We got it back. Oh, yeah. dun, dun, dun. I think that crawl space is from the Coliseum, so you know, it's going to be a doozy when we get there. Can I have something that increases my logma? Just thinking about it, I mean, if I'm going around... Miracle Armor, what do you know? Lock increases while I could be up. Oh, I almost running to her. I think there was like, yeah. Let's push this shit out of the way. Uh, different species in you. What the fuck are you? A hyena? Hyenas don't have guns. When you whip eggs, so you have more mobility. And then the whip is zero. Standing still and see if you get hit. Also, I don't believe it cancels early too, so. Nice fucking rifle.
Yeah, I think the Coliseum is right this way, but we cannot get there just, just yet. I think it's only going to... Okay, no, maybe not. Oh, need. That's good. Good thing to have. Let's get somewhere that we can heal. Dun, 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 right? Yeah, but not where I want to go. We need to go that is green and we don't want your skeletons. Yeah. This is the one that you're always going to go back to because the safe room is like right on front. That's what I remember the most. Also, we were there, but I think that was it, right? I mean, just that teleporter. Because nowhere else we could have gone to. Alright, anyways, let's go somewhere else. Ah, the bottom area of the of this place. Mm, maybe we can go that way. There's a lot of parts over there that we have not discovered yet. Alright, it's an investment of with the electric skeletons. I think we need to do a full roundabout. I did a full roundabout, but not the way I wanted to do it. So it's not a teleport, it's just like a gate. Ah, oh, damn, I miss it. Well, anyways. I'm so glad this one made it to Smash Brothers. Because one, is from this game. Second, this game is kinda like, not canon or some shit like that, it's kinda like its own universe. So I'm surprised they just put it in, like, at all. Alright, time to explore the... This bottom area. Alright. So we'll find something. We're going to kill these guys. <laughs> I see that, so I just blast for one. Bats. Nothing. Why are the walls just flaming? Alright. I mean, either you need the wrong feather for that, or you can have an ice pill to freeze them and you know, take them from there. But I have ice shit. I already got the thing for this line, so. Alright. I hope you like poison. And all poisons is to do for damage. Which is not like the worst thing ever, but you know, it sticks around. Get those noodles out of here, man. So yeah, this track, iconic. And I think he was like the main composer of Castlevania who worked on this one. Just a new person. So you know, great job. Archimon Fox Hunter. I just saw that happening, I just took it. Alright, thank you. Because I mean, Castlevania is like. It's kind of like a scary game. But you know, you're not using wimps. <laughs> you're using whips. Like, these dudes, the Castlevania crew, they can handle a problem. Ah, maybe you can check how much is it. I mean, HP 460. It's only 10, dude. Well, let's pick them up, I guess.
All right, nice roundabout. Is that you see a uh, tiny hole in the map and it's like you can probably just open it up. Let's keep it slowing the underground, I guess. It were nice to farm at the beginning. Alright, go all the way up after this. Remember when we were here, what a time that was. <laughs> this place is still on fire. Where the hell is this place anyways? Because it's a catacomb. Oh no, we're suddenly in hell. Where is this place? Alright. Hit the right. I ain't knowing what the fuck, I mean, there's a gate over there, so... I don't know, man. Don't make sense of... Don't make sense of Dracula's castle. Well, this is Carmilla's castle, but you know. You did with the power of the Dark Lord and shit. Also, yeah, they are doing, like, a collaboration with Dead by Daylight. So... <laughs> Apparently, the, you know, that by they don't name the killers as they are, they give them like, I'm not sure if a generic name is the word I'm looking for, but just a title. Because I think Dracula used the Dark Lord, or something like that. And it just references the fight with Julius that he had before he was brought into the Dead by Daylight world. And everyone is like, ah, oh, goddammit, we're never getting that game. Well, so what's the meme about that? Because, I mean, we're playing this one, another other game that references that. Soon enough, though. Uh, in Area of Sorrow, there's a character named Julius Belmont. He was the last Belmont who fought the last form of Dracula before he was sealed forever or destroyed forever. And that happened on 1999. And that was the last appearance of Dracula because apparently they killed him once and for all. However, the events of Fire Solo reveals, reveals that other thing happened to Dracula. And the last appearance of Dracula as it was, it was on that encounter that Julius Bremont did. And that encounter has no game. It's just referenced on Ario Sorrow, but there's no game about it. So we have you to find actual Julius Belmont <laughs> playable. Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, it's just free just standing there. Alright. Nowhere. Where we can check the bright side. Just gotta make sure it's not a breakable wall. And it's hidden. Oh, I need to kill everyone. Okay. Well. All these free HP up. <laughs> they go around. We'll have gotten whenever, but I didn't. Now we to the bottom, bottom one. A rock demon. Ah, sorry no. A demon, sorry. Gotta get my no make like you're right. Ba ba da ba da ba da ba da ba da ba da. Ah. That's how I use a recovery item. So good. Alright, 
we're getting we're getting all the old sound with this. I guess we just go back. Up and then right. Alright, this game I remember being it a bit more hard, but then again, I think it was my first Castlevania experience. I mean I I didn't have a PlayStation 1. I think the first console that we had that I remember owning was the Super Nintendo. And then again, we live in, you know, I live in Mexico, so the game market wasn't exactly open here, so. We didn't have that shit, and games were. Well, games are expensive. Are and can be expensive. So, no one really have video games back then. Now, it's, it's more common. You know, especially since Steam. Has like cheaper prices. I think the one that pushes pushes more like the gaming market here in Mexico was Xbox. <laughs> That's why the best players of Gears of War are fucking Mexicans. It also helped, and I think this is always the case. What helped Gears is that it was translated in Latin American Spanish, and the crew who helped to translate it, I think they also translated Dragon Ball Z. You know how much we love that. I'm not really a Dragon Ball Z fan, by the way. Yeah, already, right? I mean, I like it, I respect it, but it's not like, oh yeah, I'm going to watch Dragon Ball Z. But maybe I should watch it back. I mean, it's just one of those things, right? But I will watch it from the beginning. I will... I'm not... I'm not a... Cowards, like the fake JoJo fans who skip part 1 and 2, they're cowards, part 1 is my favorite, <laughs> for JoJo. Right. I was going to say all the underground is cooler, but no, I'm missing that last part over there. Mm, Alright. Can't get there directly, but just going to the right. I was thinking there should be an option to avoid not back. And I think there is, but on newer games. I'm not sure about it. But I think I remember. And I think I know for a fact that Arya Sorrow does that. You have a, a strength stat, I think it's called. And it just avoids no not back. Because if you have low knockback shit, low strength, so many of us are going to push your screens away. I remember I was replaying the game doing like a second playthrough. And there's this enemy, I think it's a Minotaur, that's does an uppercut. I don't know if I was just speedrunning the game because that thing uppercut me and just launched me like two rooms away. <laughs> so you know. I don't remember it ever happening. Zombie thief. <laughs> Alright, my up. So well, anyways. So that's that. Because I mean, there's just no way I just jump, bump into the skeleton, and it's like, ah, just push me away. I guess it's part of the Castlevania meme, but you know, maybe it doesn't meme that up. Alright. I guess I can go whatever up in the next room and just take it from there. Ah, uh, ah, uh, wait, didn't you drop a card or something? Yeah, but, like, I was expecting to get it, but you know. Should I just try to farm that shit? Well, I mean, it's just enter and whip. <laughs> Never mind. That was, that was nice. Serpent. What type of card are you? Oh, nice. It's a nice weapon. Do you think we can do that shit that I said that we could do? 
maybe we could. Alright. Usually, uh, there's like an. Well, maybe we can do it now, actually. Those like ice ball, and I think that's that helps better. What it does? Who knows? All right. What what do you do? Defense is Chris. All right. That's good. Yeah, it's this one. Maybe this is convenient because I mean, if you freeze them, you can walk through them. This is faster than the fireball too, so... Good for low level enemies, I guess. Let's see what I think so. Ice project or something? Yep. Ah, some contra shit. <laughs> Alright, ice whip. Well, let's keep it just for this area a little. Bum, 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 bum. Now we're hmm we're gonna go to the area on the left. Yeah. Let's see what they ask for us. Oh god, they also destroy some other projectiles, that's good. I mean I know it has a like a chance of missing but you know it's uh I'm gonna say it's more convenient than oh. No, the guy goes too strong. That's unfortunate that the first one does, that's what I mean. <laughs> also, next week, um, next week, which for you is probably going to be last week, depending on when I upload this. But next week, for me, I'm done with Anarchy Rings and the Nameless game, so you know, something else is going to take the place. And I have been recording a couple of things, but you know. Just going up right like what's uh does Yeah. Yeah. There's a cloud tower, right? We were there. Welcome to the filler episode everybody. Alright, I, I think I need I need to go back to the other thing. Get out of here, Tempers of the Night. You do drop something. Nice. I'm really testing my luck on this right. I'm pretty sure the RNG is like brave. Or, I mean, I don't know. You can only just keep whipping until something happens. Alright, just going to do it one or two more times. I don't want to be here all day. Huh, Manticore. That's a good one. Well, it doesn't matter what type of card it is, I was going to say what type of card it is, but because I mean, anyone does combinations. Even if it's top of bottom. Poison. Alright. In double hearts. Nice, it's fun. How cool is this, anyways?
I mean, it's very constant, that's for sure. And it's a passive, so pretty useful. Let's see what project we have. Just let you fall. <laughs> when the whip is swung upward, there is a poison shower. You could have just written anywhere, anything else. Alright. I need to go on. I'm not sure if I want to venture over there with this held. Maybe I can. I was thinking, don't you get like the clear poison water after you beat Camila? And it's like, that's crazy, that's not possible. Uh, clearly a rock feather, alright. Or whatever they call it in this game. Rock feather, what is this, Zelda? Maybe. No, wrong. Alright, there's something to investigate here. Ah, oh, thank you. I almost regretted that. <laughs> Just get thrown back all the way down. Nah, then replace the holy water. Alright, you do get frozen after one hit, so that's good. Ah, oh, what do you know? What do you know? This was here all this time. All right, let's, let's keep going up. There you go. All right, all right, speed runner guy, just <laughs> have some patience. Bam, boom, ba -da -ba -da. Come a little dance. I know you're hiding another place around here, so no, all right, whatever. I didn't do that because I thought I was going to rock climb again. Stopwatch. They really want you to have this. How much is this stopwatch? Is it like 20 or something? Yep. Does this shit work on bosses now? Car, so. <laughs> it's got the boomerang. No, it was only my nightmares. Ow. I think there was a break of wall over there, was there? Hope not. I don't get mad as much, but you know, if, if, I'm, if I was there, might as well. <laughs> eh. All right, now now I want to know if you can if you can do this shit. Uh, well, I mean, you know what? It works out. And I'm pretty sure we're ready to work here, but I just want to check something. Alright. I 
Let's see what else. Well, there's that place. On top. And they keep hitting him if you're on the ground. An axe. Alright. Coming down. Send this like. Yeah. Oh, well, we can probably do the, the meme of prison shit. Probably. Yeah, we'll probably need the rock for the shit. Well, well, well. Alright, convenient. But still, we don't have a place to go. At least yet. Let's check that other room. Uh, it's all the way down again. Mm. Yeah, but let's not go through the underground again. Uh, Alright, I'm going to save and then I'm going to meme my way over there. Because I swear to God, I cannot find the clear water thing. At least this will be a funny because I think I'm gonna collect this already. It will be a funny thing before calling it quits. Oh well. I was just about to remove the the eye circle thing. What I mean six? Was it four last time? Probably because. All right. What do we have this though? That did a lot of freaking damage, dude. Yeah, maybe we didn't want to do that. That is not yet. <laughs> Alright, gonna hear us. Well, the guy comes this way. The defense activated, but I didn't see any damage. I don't think it makes us imperfect as to the shit. Oh god. Ah. It does fuck all for us, actually. So maybe want some, some extra defense on this area? Of course there's ring, yeah. You got terrible luck, yeah, but I want to survive, dude. And it's still six anyway, so... Mm. Or whatever. Why not get to fight anyways? Uh. <laughs> uh, especially when I use this. Oh my god, um, it's all. Oh, it's. Pff, 130. Fucking, you know, I just killed me already. Alright. That was fun, but I'm gonna quit for now. Thank you so much for watching. Guess I'll see you and see everyone. Take care. Sorry for the filler episode, but it is what it is. Well, guess I'll see you later then. Roger your teeth, flood your teeth. Stay safe, and uh, well, I'll be seeing you. Bye now.